add and subtract customary units. So we have five cups minus three cups and two fluid ounces minus five fluid ounces. So let's start with our ounces first. Can I subtract two minus five? Well, I can't um, without getting into negative numbers and we don't wanna do that. So we're gonna have to take a cup and turn one of these cups into fluid ounces. So we know that one cup equals eight fluid ounces. So if we take one cup away from five, we now have four cups. So I'm gonna erase this and I'm gonna cross this out and say four cups. And then if we add eight fluid ounces to two fluid ounces, now we have 10 fluid ounces. So now we can cross out all of this. So four cups minus three cups is one cup and 10 fluid ounces minus five fluid ounces is five. So one cup, five ounces. We have seven cups, two fluid ounces, plus how many cups and how many fluid ounces equals seven cups and six fluid ounces. So let's start with fluid ounces. We have two and we wanna get to six. So two plus what equals six? Well, two plus four equals six. And we have seven and we wanna get to seven. So seven plus what equals seven? Well, seven plus zero. So this would be zero cups and four fluid ounces. Now we have one pound, 13 ounces, minus one pound, eight ounces. So let's start with our ounces. 13 minus eight, well 13 minus eight equals five. And one pound minus one pound equals zero. So zero pounds, five ounces. Now we have four pounds, seven ounces, plus three pounds, 10 ounces. So let's add our ounces. So there's 10 plus seven. Well, 10 plus seven is 17. And four plus three equals seven. Well, there are only 16 ounces in a pound. So we can't write it like this because there are too many ounces. So let's take away a pound. So if we take away a pound, we're left with one ounce, which means we need to add that pound to our other one, which would give us eight pounds, one ounce. Now we have how many gallons plus pints? So we're gonna look and see here at blank gallons equals or blank gallons plus this many pints equals one gallon plus six pints so let's start with our um, pints so if we look here we have this many pints plus six equals two so that must mean that we are going to go over our usual so if we're going how many pints we know that there are eight pints in a gallon, so something plus six is going to get us to two. So we can look at that as two over eight, and two over eight would equal 10. So six plus what equals 10? So six plus four would equal 10. So four pints, which would give us an extra gallon. So really, this would be seven gallons. So something gallons plus one gallon equals seven gallons. So six gallons plus four pints. So let's try that and let's just double check. Six gallons, four pints. So what's four plus six? Well, that equals 10. So 10 would be two pints plus one more extra gallon. So six plus one plus one equals eight. So that's correct. So let's type in six and four. Nice job. Now we have two feet, 10 inches, plus blank feet, blank inches, equals six feet, 11 inches. So if we're at 10 inches, and we are going to add inches to get to 11, well, there's 12 inches in a foot, so 11 isn't over. So 10 plus one equals 11. We're at two feet. 
we're gonna add this amount and then we're gonna get to six. So two plus what equals six? Well, two plus four equals six. So four feet, one inch. We have seven gallons, zero cups equals, or seven gallons, zero cups minus four gallons, how many cups equals two gallons, seven cups. So there are 16 cups in a gallon. So 16 cups equals a gallon. So we need to remember that. So we have zero cups and we're taking away a certain amount of cups which then give us seven cups. So how many cups would we have to take away to get to seven? Well, zero minus what? So let's take away this seven gallons and make this six gallons and make this zero cups into 16 cups. So 16 minus what equals seven? Well, 16 minus nine equals seven. Now we can start six minus four should equal two. So our missing number here is nine. Two yards, one foot, minus one yard, two foot, equals how many yards? Two feet. So this one, we need to figure out how many yards are in a feet. Well, three feet equals one yard. So that's important to know. So we're starting here, one foot minus two foot equals two foot. Well, we can't really do that. So let's take away a yard and let's have one yard. And if one yard equals three feet, then this three plus one equals four feet. So four feet minus two feet equals two feet. So one yard minus one yard equals zero yards. Eight feet, 10 inches minus three feet, 10 in inches equals five feet, how many inches? So start with our inches, 10 inches minus 10 inches. We can do that. So 10 inches minus 10 inches equals zero inches and eight feet minus three feet equals five feet, so our missing number is zero. Ooh, now we're looking at tons here. We're looking at tons. So tons is a lot more than our previous amount. So there are 2,000 tons or 2,000 pounds, I'm sorry, equals a ton. So if we're looking here, we have nine tons minus one ton and 1,745 minus 1,042. Well, we can do that, which gives us 703. So now let's take away nine tons minus one ton. Well, nine ton minus one ton equals eight tons. Nice work today.